yo 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 what's up this is Julia from Tom W today we are reviewing Brio VSK Pro thank you Brio for sending out this product and we are going to unbox it and answer a question should you buy it or not so let's jump into it all right so let's start with the box box is really good matte black and no bullshit, it's a really pretty tough box, so you don't have to worry about any damage when you pretty much arrive it. So, on the top of box, I don't know if you can see it or not, but I'm gonna try to adjust the light a bit. And if you see, they've just given us what's like what are the three main things in the box. So, there's this trimmer with the charging socket, and there's this blade, and there's this um, travel case. So, that's the first thing when you see the box. And towards the side, they will mention all the features on both sides that are available on the trimmer. So I'm just going to read really quick to it. And if you want to find the detailed review, like all the features, I'm going to leave the link of our blog in the bottom section and you can check it out. So firstly, it says the trimmer is extra quiet. So the low friction blade balance spindle and insulated motor makes BSK one of the quietest trimmers available. Is this true or no? Is it a fact or cap? We will see and when we try it on. Then it's a convenient cut. There's different ad adjustments than the zero blade. Okay, this is the main feature to have. The blade you see over here is a zero blade. So they got a zero blade if you want to cut really close. So that's a good thing to have. And not a lot of trimmers give these things out, but it's a good one to have. It's a quick charge, full charge in three hours and then you can use it and I think if I'm not wrong I was, when I was checking it out they will display that says how much time remaining in the trimmer so it's a good thing to have then it has a battery that will last four hours on one charge and ceramic blades that is pro case so good that's a good thing if you're traveling you don't have to carry it in a plastic bag let's be honest no one wants to carry a trimmer in a plastic bag right it's a good thing to have a pro case and then the design so they have a five speed setting on the trimmer and let's see let's open it so oh and one more thing guys this is the thing this is one of the most good things to have behind the box and you know utilize the space because not a lot of trimmers give this thing it tells you what are like what's in the box and it has a cable it has a charger then zero blade it has four blades that are dual sides so like you can use two sides which is a great thing to have if you want to save the space like if you are compared this real beard skip to philips novelco they give small blades like 20 30s of those blades it's really hard to find the one you're looking for so this is a good thing to have four blades two sides and yeah what else do you need in life right and yeah that's pretty much it with the box let's open it okay nothing major in the box just the case Ooh, the case is kind of heavy not gonna lie the case is not like really lightweight it's kind of your warning kit so if you have to travel you have to make a decision if you want to carry this much stuff the, but the keys, it looks pretty hard. I'm trying to press it. Nothing. It's a hard case, hard shell case, and um, looks good quality. So it has a zipper which you can use and a logo of beer over here. So let's go ahead and open this thing. Okay, bunch of manuals. And yeah, looks pretty clean and i'm gonna show it to you guys one minute okay so this is the trimmer this is the box so the box is pretty good it's arranged pretty neat like when i got my philips no elko oh bro that was like i had to arrange those things for five ten minutes and that took like my unboxing experience it wasn't too good but this thing is the real thing like it gives you a proper unboxing experience and you get what you're paying for so this is the trimmer four blades charging case wire trimmer this is the uh, what is this? this is the power adapter and it has 
a nice lightweight power adapter and then the zero blade i was talking about good quality zero blade and it's easy to fix on the other side you get three manuals the first manual is this one it's just the product description charging your trimmer basic instructions i'm not going to bore you with this one then register to receive a 10 percent it's a 10 percent off coupon and then oh this is a nice one so check this out guys so in this one they give you all the different lens settings and they compare it with different trimmers so this is a wall comparison oster and endis with this guy's beard skip review they compare their trimmer settings to wall oster and endis which are the three main ones if you don't know in the beard industry so and they have your different micro settings guard size and it's a good thing to have and when you are in a if you are buying this trimmer for a saloon or if you are buying it for professional cuts and stuff then this is a must have so i'm gonna keep this in for now then on the other side quickly i'm gonna check what's there Ooh, it's a um, mineral oil for cleaning the trimmer so not a lot of companies give this you have to buy this separately for i'll say ten dollars on amazon so this is a good thing to that they gave this and this makes sure that your trimmer lasts uh, at least two to three years and then there's one more thing there's a cleaning brush again good thing to have most companies don't give this out because um, they sell this separately but it's a good thing to have good job review with the packing i like the packing guys not gonna lie one of the best unboxing i ever had then let's see what we got over here let's start with the trimmer trimmer is regular weight it's not too heavy it's not too light same weight so um sleek design matte finish uh brio weird scape and looks pretty awesome so i'm gonna walk you through what's what so first of all if you see the blades blades are really high quality blades so it has like the adjustable white uh, it seems like plastic but it's not plastic i'm gonna guarantee you that so this is the adjustable material and this is the metal blade and the trimmer is here and the first thing you see this is the blade setting that i was talking about so you lower this thing i'm gonna and then this thing is lower so if you see you have this much is the length setting for cutting out and then if you rise it above you press it setting the white blade comes up so it is the adjust adjustment for the different style different types of beard styles different type of haircut you want and this is a good thing to have philips noel code doesn't have this thing it has just one button power button so there's no um, adjustments over that you have to change blades every time you want a different cut but this one is the real thing so it's good to have the adjustable button right here then they got the speed control too again philips norelco which is one of the best beard trimmers on the market as people say doesn't have the speed control it's just one speed so that's that and a button and a led display so let's power on the trimmer okay the noise is pretty average i'm not they said it's noise free but it is the um, same noise as philips norelco and other trimmers out there so um, noise is not too much of an issue and then you got the speed setting so as you increase the speed the battery life decreases that's the common phenomenon so at the most normal um, charge you get 234 minutes which is uh, at the 50 rpm which is like the you know, basics like the lowest speed it goes to and you get 233 minutes which is a good time and then as you increase the speed as you can see over here as I increase the speed, the time decreases and uh, the speed is increasing. You can hear the sound that's increasing and yeah, the speed controls are pretty good and the time is good too. So the streamer, um, I'll say out of 10, I'll give the streamer an 8. I'm going to give one mark off because of the noise and then other mark just because of the weight it's not too light and it's not too heavy but nothing to complain about too much I, on average i give beard trimmer seven to six this is eight so 
pretty good video. Then this is a socket that comes with it for the charging. Um, I'm gonna plug it in. Okay, it stays on itself and you can use the wire that it came with. I'm not gonna show you that one because it's not necessary. And it has the wire, power adapter and um, the socket. So everything is covered. You don't need to buy a single thing if you buy this weird trimmer. And then I'm gonna walk you through the different set bleed settings. So this one is 15 and 18. 15 millimeter, uh, millimeter above like one side and 18 on the other side and this is a good use of space like most trimmers they only use one side and they like the different attachment for the different side but what Brio did is like, it's one attachment you can use two sides like you can use one side then if you want to change it use the other one so less space in the box like you don't need to carry everything like 30 blades like Philips Norelco just you carry four blades and that covers major of everything and I like that. So this is blade number one, which is 18 and 15. Blade number two, 12 and nine. Blade number three, three and six. And uh, last blade, which is one and two. So this one is good one. Uh, blades are made of, uh, I'll say, normal blade quality, which seems like plastic, but um, it, um, I think this uh, blades are plastic made, so. It's good because you don't need to use the blades every time. It's just if you want to change the hair settings, you want to give a nice fade. That's what this for. And then the most important part, which is a zero blade. This is what's the most important thing. And it is made of like really high quality and matte finish. So this is kind of heavy, but that's because of the great quality it comes with. So Thank you for watching this guys. This was the unboxing for Brio Beard Skip. It's a great trimmer. But, okay wait. I forgot to answer one question. Should you buy it or not? And so, if you ask me if I had the option to buy, of buying this trimmer with Philips No Elko, I'll buy Brio Beard Skip. The price is pretty premium price. And that's because it comes with a lot of um, quality and uh, perfection. So, I'll say yes, do buy Brio Beard Skip. It's a worth investment and this will last around two to three years if you maintain it and clean it reg at regular intervals. So if you spread out the cost between three years, then this is a pretty good investment. And I will leave you with this. Thank you and have a nice day.